Hello and welcome to Web Design and Development course using HTML5 and CSS3. This is an introduction to HTML5 and CSS3. Here you'll see the source and reference for this video. I hope you'll be able to follow along this web design course. The prerequisites for this course are the following. Sublime Text Editor and a web browser. As you watch this video, please bear in mind about our ESLRs. And these are right thought, right communication, right attitude, right conduct, and right lifestyle. Now let's move on to our lesson. Section 10, Getting Your Site on the Internet. Lesson 10.5, Site Map. A sitemap is a list of all the pages on your website. In addition, a sitemap can list other resources on a page, such as images and videos. You can also add information about how often a page is updated and when it was last changed. A sitemap can be submitted to search engines and ensure that all the pages are referenced and crawled. You can create a sitemap yourself using XML, but this is very complex and time consuming. The easiest way to create one is via free sitemap generators. Do a Google search for sitemaps. Once your sitemap is generated, you'll have an XML file that you can upload to your web space. Place it in the same folder as your index.html web page, the root folder in other words. Your sitemap can be submitted to all the main search engines. For Google, you need to sign up for Google Webmaster Tools. But generally, search engines will see the sitemap by themselves and use it to index your site accordingly. For more details and classwork in this lesson, please check Google Classroom. Thank you.